Good morning, Facebook, YouTube, Daily Motion, and Twitter. This is Rich again, back for your first video blog of the day for Tuesday, February 10th, 2015, around 7.47 in the morning in Berwick, Massachusetts. S snowing a little bit again. What else is new? Hopefully we could get some sunshine. We're still in a snowy pattern, which sucks, but we have to deal with it. Sooner or later, we're going to get some s warmer weather, I hope. Some news to report, Spurs coach Greg Popovich recorded his 1,000th victory last night. And Marv Albert's going to be returning to NBC Sports to call some boxing matches with Sugar Ray Leonard. They're going to call some primetime fights on NBC beginning um, March 7th. And that's about it on the news. My first video subject of the day is the top 10 everything and anything. I've reached the top 10 greatest best sports talk show host ever from anywhere in the United States. Sports talk shows have been very popular on the radio for many years and sports talk radio on, has been around since the 80s. It really boomed in the 90s and there's so many sports talk radio stations across the country. And here are the top 10 host sports talk show hosts on the radio of all time. Number 10 on this list is Mike Adams. Mike Adams host is the week night host on sports radio WEEI in Boston from 6 to 10 p.m. It's a Planet Mikey show. Mikey's a very funny guy. He's been around the sports business for over 30 years. He has Lenny Miguel Megaliola usually as his guest and he has also a few others. He has the he has the email females and his one of his famous Quote is calling now, but holes. I think they didn't want to do that for the butt instead of the ass. Comes in at number 10. Number 9 on the all time list of greatest, best sports talk show host ever. Mike Response, the sports pig. The sports pig was on the sports fan radio network in the 1990s. It was a weekend host, and Mike Response always would talk negative about Boston and stuff like that. And Mike Response passed away in 2012. After he, at, that was very sad. He passed away so young, but he was a great sports talk show host on the radio. Mike Response. He comes in at number nine, number eight on the old time list. I guess best sports talk show host ever. Dale Arnold. Dale Arnold is the two to six p.m. host of sports radio WEI with Michael Harley. Dale has been around the sports radio talk business in Boston since 1991. Worked for WEI for many, many years. He's had so many partners, Eddie Anderman and Bob Newmeyer. Dale's also the host of Nesson's Bruins coverage, and Dale is a very great guy. He's very knowledgeable. He comes in at number eight. Number seven on the list of the greatest sports talk show hosts ever on the radio, Mike Francesca. Mike Francesca is an institution in New York. He, for many years, he teamed up with the Mad Dog on Chris Russo and they were formed Mike and the Mad Dog on WFAN. It was also Samuel Cast on the Yes Network. Many, many years they were partners but eventually they broke up. And Mike Francesca has his um, show Samuel Cast on Fox Sports 1 and Fox Sports 2 weekdays. He's real knowledgeable. He's, he's a great talk show host. He, Comes in at number seven. Number six on the old time list of greatest sports talk show host on the radio ever, Tim Brando. Tim Brando's been hosting a sports talk show on the radio since 2002. First off, for Sporting News Radio, then Yahoo Sports Radio, and now College Sports Radio on XM Satellite Radio. His show, the Tim Brando show, was simulcast for a few years on the CBS Sports Network. He's real knowledgeable, real opinionated, and he's one of the best. He comes in at number six, number five on the old time list of the best sports talk show host ever on the radio, Papa Joe Savaglia. Papa Joe Savaglia used to host a sports talk show on Sporting News Radio from 6 to 10 week nights for many years. Then he went to Vegas to host a local sports talk show. He appeared a couple of times on IMAX. Max Kalman ill-fated sports show on Fox Sports Net. And Papa Joe Savaglia was a big Pittsburgh Steelers fan, but Papa Joe passed away at the at 
2011 from complications of diabetes and, and he was in his mid 50s. He comes in at number five. Number four on the old time, those are the greatest sports talk show host there on the radio. Glenn Ordway, the big O. Glenn Ordway was the long time 2 to 6 p.m. host on sports radio, WEI, for many years. He hosted the big show with the big O, with so many sports radio, with sports personalities in Boston. It was a real popular show for many, many years until 2013 when WEI pulled the plug because of sinking ratings. Now, the, the big show, Glenn Ordway has his own talk show, which is syndicated throughout New England, and it's also on XM Satellite Radio on the way and the internet and Glenn always a great talk show host he comes in at number four number three on the old time list of greatest sports talk show host ever on the radio JT the Brick J, J, JT the Brick has hosted sports um, radio shows for many years first for the sports fan radio network then for Fox Sports Radio it's syndicated throughout the country and he's a great host JT the Brick he appears on, on at on some other shows, he's also a big Oakland Raiders fan, and he's written a few books. JT the Brick comes in at number three. Number two on the old time most of the greatest, best sports talk show host ever on the radio, Eddie Anderman, the godfather of sports talk radio in Boston. He, Eddie Anderman's been on the air since 1969. He formed the Sports Huddle with Mark Gretkin and Jim McCarthy. They were on several radio stations, w, the old WEI, WBZ, WHDH. That, then towards the late 80s, Eddie Anderman hosted his weekday sports talk show, Anything Goes, on WEI. Then, then it moved to the Sports Zone, 1510, the Sports Zone, and then 96.9 FM talk for a few years. Eddie Anderman, from time to time, on Boston Hills Radio from 12 to 1 with Anything Goes, once in a while, and Eddie Landerman loves the Kowloon. See you soon at the Kowloon. And the number one best sports talk show host ever on the radio is Ted Sarandis. Ted Sarandis hosted the popular Ted Nation show on WEI for many years. From 7 to midnight, Ted Sarandis was the only sports radio host in Boston who always promoted college sports. He was a big college football Base, I mean, basketball fan. He was the voice of BC for many years, and he would always say wow and stuff. And Ted Sarandos sometimes get mad at his callers. And if they said something that if they were intoxicated, he would say, Can you do me one favor? Can you stay off the Boston Road? After Ted Sarandos left WEI in October 2005, he filled in once in a while for Eddie Landerman on 96.5. 9 FM Talk, and then he briefly hosted a weekend sports show on the Sports Hub. Ted Sarandis now lives in West Palm Beach, Florida, out on sports business, but he's the best sports talk show host ever on the radio, Ted Sarandis. That's about it on that. I'll be back later. Facebook friends, YouTube follows Daily Motion, and Twitter. Two more video blogs. The first one will be about the Larry Savisco Bruno San Martino feud of 1980 in the WWE, and the third and final video blog of the night will be about. Pro Basketball Hall of Famer Oscar Robinson. Have a good day, everybody. See you later.